Good afternoon. President Barack Obama's new and improved healthcare website faces yet another test in just a couple of weeks, its biggest yet. If healthcare.gov becomes overwhelmed by an expected year-end crunch, many Americans will be left facing a break in their insurance coverage. Until now, the main damage from the website's technology woes has been to Obama's poll ratings. But if it chokes again, it will be everyday people feeling the consequences. Some of those at risk are among the more than 4 million consumers whose individual policies have been canceled because the coverage didn't comply with the requirements of the new health care law. A smaller number, several hundred thousand, are in federal and state programs for people whose health problems already were a barrier to getting private insurance before the overhaul. Residents in parts of the Dakotas began their work week dealing with icy roads and sidewalks as a three-wave storm began sweeping over the northern Great Plains. The storm promised to bring significant snowfall to North Dakota and parts of South Dakota midweek, and then usher in bitterly cold and dangerous temperatures late in the week. The Weather Service issued a winter storm warning for western and central North Dakota through Wednesday, as snow was expected to develop over the south-central and southeast parts of the state after midnight. Wind gusts exceeding 30 miles per hour were expected to create areas of blowing and drifting snow. The Minnesota Vikings won 23-20 against the Chicago Bears last, last Sunday. They have a current 3-8-1 record with a tie to the Green Bay Packers. The Detroit Lions lead the NFC North Division with a 7-5 record. They are followed by Chicago at 6-6, Green Bay at 5-6-1, and, and the Vikings at the bottom of the division. Tomorrow's afternoon high will be 5 degrees Fahrenheit. It will be cloudy with a 40% chance of snow. Wind from the northwest at 22 miles per hour. Tomorrow night's low will be negative 8 degrees with mostly cloudy skies and a 10% chance of showers. Wind from the northwest at 18 miles per hour. You're listening to 88.1 KJKR on JCTV Channel 16.